Hickcom. Well, today, August 2nd, marks the anniversary of the shooting of James Butler Hickok, better known as Wild Bill Hickok. Later this month, to commemorate the anniversary, Wild Bill's gun will be sold at auction, and it's expected to bring a lot of money. The legendary story of gunslinger and lawman Wild Bill Hickok and where he was shot in Saloon Number no. 10 in Deadwood, South Dakota, has been told countless times, including a story by CBS's Charles Corral. The dead man was Wild Bill Hickok. Hickok's Smith & Wesson Model No. 2 was reportedly his favorite sidearm and considered one of the holy grails of the American West. It'll be auctioned off later this month. What do you think this gun's going to bring? The official estimate actually that we have on there is $150,000 to $350,000. We actually just sold a different revolver of Wild Bill Hickox in our May premier firearms auction. It sold for $616,000. So absolutely shattered our expectations. The gun is an iconic collectible for the Western firearms collector. The revolver features a standard six-inch barrel, blue finish, and rosewood grips. But it's the history and the stories that are attached to this gun that makes it highly sought after. He's the lawman, he's the gambler, he's the drinker, he's the gunfighter, he's the scout, the spy, the, the showman, you name it. He's, he's done it all. There's still a shrine for Hickok inside saloon number 10. In fact, an entire wall is dedicated to him and the chair where he was sitting when he was shot by assassin Jack McCall. As the story goes, Hickok had beaten Jack McCall in gambling the day before and offered to buy him breakfast the following day. He took offense to that. And the next day, uh, while Bill was playing poker, uncharacteristically with his back towards the door, uh, that was not a position he liked to be in. But when he went to sit down at the table, there was no other spot. Unfortunately, that allowed uh, Jack McCall to, to get the jump on him and kill him by shooting him in the back of the head in that uh, number 10 saloon. Now to learn more about Rock Island Auction Company and when Wild Bill Smith & Wesson will be up for auction, along with some other collectibles, log on to this story on Kettleland.com.